I absolutely adore the first of the month because the first of the month means my keto subscription boxes are coming and we get to do an unboxing. And today's unboxing is going to be Keto Chow. I love Keto Chow. And if you've not checked out the Chow Club, you need to. There are actually two different types of subscription boxes that you can look into. I will have both of those linked in the description box if you want to go check those out. And I'm also going to have my Keto Chow discount code linked down there in case you do want to pick up some little packets, some samples, or if you want to pick up some electrolytes or the larger packages. So before we open up the October chow club box let me go over what keto chow is i did an entire video on it if you want to check it out i'll link it in the cards for you but let me tell you a little bit about keto chow keto chow is going to be a keto friendly low carb meal replacement shake basically different from what you find on the market when you go in stores those are usually like your high protein shakes this isn't so you get the packets or the big bags. They'll contain the powder in that and then you'll add your liquid of choice and you'll add your fat of choice. They have sweet flavors. They have savory flavors. You can use this for making your ice cream. You're gonna be able to use this in baking biscuits. The possibilities are endless and they do have tons of recipes and lots of different flavors. I've personally been drinking keto chow a lot here lately and Chris likes to take it on the road with him when he's traveling because it makes it easier for him. I've heard stories about people having oral surgery, just don't have time to cook meals. They like their keto chow you have so many different options to choose from. But today, like I said, we are gonna be doing the unboxing of the October's Chow Club box. Two to choose from. Check the link below. Okay, let's start this month's unboxing. And it looks like right on top, we have several of the vanilla packets. These are your individual style packets. And you can see right here that the vanilla only has 0.4 carbs per serving. Looks like there are eight packets of the vanilla this month. Vanilla is always a good one to have on hand because you're gonna be able to mix it with so many different things. So if you wanna make this a more smoothie type consistency, you can add your fats, you can add your warm liquid, blend it up, then add a couple of handfuls of ice, maybe some fruit and a vanilla one, blend this up and it makes it a smoothie milkshake type consistency. That's my favorite way to do my keto chow. So I do wanna give you an example in case this is the first time you've seen an unboxing. So if you take your keto chow mixture and you mix this with half a stick of melted butter and your warm liquid of choice, most people use water, you're gonna blend all of that together. Then you can put this in the refrigerator overnight and you can let it see it that way, all of your flavors come together or do like I do and add those handfuls of ice and then you're gonna be able to drink it immediately. But your calories are gonna be 528. You're gonna have 46.28 grams of fat, 26.6 total protein. Your carb count, total carb count is going to be 6.7 on this one. And you're gonna have 5.9 dietary fiber. This is going to leave you with right there, 0 0.4 net carbs. 0 0.4 net carbs. So if you're doing net carbs, you're gonna love you some keto chow. And it's extremely filling. If you've never had one, you're gonna get full on this. This is definitely not like your little drink. It is a meal replacement. Plus you're gonna see right here in the ingredients, you're getting additionals. You're getting vitamin D, 100% of your vitamin D. You're getting calcium, you're getting 12% of your iron. You're getting potassium, 33% of that. And then you can see down here your ingredients and it is going to be sucralose sweetened, but that's gonna be one of the very last ingredients. Okay, let me show you what the inside of the box looks like after I took the vanilla out. So in the subscription box, you're gonna be getting some recipes and you always get this fun little extra bonus, a treat. We've got recipe boxes in the past. We have got aprons in the past and this time, you're getting some wooden utensils to cook with and they even say keto chow right here. So you're getting the spoon and you're getting the spatula. As far as additional packets that are gonna be in here, there are two orange cream. This is one of Chris's favorite flavors. 
and this one is going to be 0.7 net carbs per serving now if you want to know complete carbs total carbs on this it would be 7.6 so if you are counting total carbs you can definitely fit this in your macros two chocolate this is another one of those universal flavors that you're going to be able to mix other things with if you want to mix in a handful of strawberries you can a scoop of your strawberry perfect keto collagen get in your collagen people but this one's going to be 1.8 net carbs per serving there's going to be two snickerdoodle we love the snickerdoodle we even own this one in the large bag and this one's going to be 0.8 two strawberries and this one is going to be 0.7 net carbs now if we go by total carbs it's going to be 6.43 again very doable two cookies and cream this one is going to be 0.7 net carbs and you're going to get 6.43 total carbs this is one i've still not tried and i need to i need to go look up some recipes on this one because i'm not sure if i would like this in shake form but i bet it would make an amazing like mousse possibly even ice cream check this one out there are four of the guava grapefruit i'm all about summer flavors they're my favorite love me some lemon love some grapefruit anything citrus i'm just all about so this one is going to be 0.8 net carbs and if you want to go with total carbs it's going to be 7.23 on this one I'm not sure if this would be good mixed with butter though i'm thinking it'd probably be better mixed with heavy whipping cream but that's the great thing about keto chow you get to pick whatever your favorite fat is some people even add in like avocado oil olive oil and things like that but you have options speaking of citrus this one's going to be the lemon meringue and it's going to be 0.8 net carbs and your total carbs are going to be seven and a half i do like the lemon meringue i think chris does too and he's not a real big lemon person but again remember you're going to be able to find recipes over on the keto chow website that's going to show you how to incorporate your keto chow mixes into those looks like there's two apple pies this one is going to be 0.8 net carbs total carbs is 7.77 see how specific they are this company knows what they're doing they're not just giving you the rounded up number they're being extremely specific with all of their numbers on the back where their nutritional information is this one is going to be really good mixed with collagen i have mixed it with the cinnamon toast i've mixed it with the salted caramel collagen by perfect keto also delicious it just gives me an opportunity to be able to get in a meal and my collagen at the same time in case i didn't mention keto chow does use redmond real salt and that's going to be a salt that is mined in utah in case you don't know that's where the company right here is based out of too is in utah and we're getting some savory flavors in this month's box creamy tomato basil these make amazing bases for soup this is always my favorite portion of the unboxing is the recipes that are going to be included with this month's okay Ooh. okay i think i know what i'm going to be doing with the guava grapefruits here is guava grapefruit pound cake. Uh, I think that sounds amazing. Here is going to be the pizza chaffle recipe, and that one's going to be using the creamy tomato basil. Apple pie butter beer. What? Oh, we're huge Harry Potter fans, people. So we're going to be definitely trying this one. So we're only talking things like heavy whipping cream, diet cream sodas, uh, rum extract erythritol did i say butter and heavy cream so it's not like these are going to be recipes that are difficult and not going to be recipes where you don't have the ingredients and maybe you have to go shopping lemon bars i bet those are good and it's another one of those where i actually have everything on hand and i could make this tonight if i wanted to and then check this one out it's vanilla birthday cake 
October is Kerrigan's birthday month. So maybe I'll make this so that I can have some birthday cake. <laughs> there are uh, more ingredients, obviously, in a birthday cake than there are some of your more simple type of recipes. You guys know all about making birthday cakes when we go with keto recipes. It's gonna be like almond flour, coconut flour, and things like that. And it looks like that's what's going on here, but we're talking sour cream, almond milk, baking powder. Again, all things that I have in my pantry. So I would be able to make this immediately if I need to. And it's even got the frosting recipe right here. October's keto crate that I have, my subscription had five recipe cards, two wooden cooking utensils with the Keto Child logo right on the handle and 30 individual packets. If Keto Child's not for you, I completely understand. This is something that helps me on my low carb, keto friendly lifestyle, and it helps Chris, especially when he's traveling. So this is one of the variations of the subscription box. There's another one, so you do have two to choose from. And if you just wanna pick up some individual packets, maybe a starter bundle to get a taste of a keto chow to see if you like it or even one of the elites then make sure you check the two links that are going to be down below i'm going to go fix me some keto chow actually because this is going to be my lunch for the day thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you all in the next video and i hope everybody has a great day bye